9 came close, but when it comes to the greatest ever tank, there can be only one. Germany had been banned from making tanks after World War II. They just hadn't played nice with the ones they'd had. But by the 1970s, a new Germany was allowed back into the tank shed, and the technological excellence that created the Panther spawned a new generation of big cat. Leopard, the greatest ever tank. It's an excellent machine. You compare it with other tanks, and you'll see that it's smaller, lighter, and faster. I think it's the best combination of firepower and mobility on the planet at the moment. The perfect tank, it's got to be mobile, it's got to be armor protected, it's got to have firepower. Leo 2 does all those in space. It's an excellent tank. It may be German engineering, but the Leopard 2 is a statement of European identity. It is a combination of the best firepower, the best protection, and the best mobility in the world today. Leopard 2 must be a contender for one of the greatest tanks ever. Not just a contender, Leopard is the greatest ever tank. And here in Sweden, 280 Leopards prowl the countryside. After the demise of the S-Tank, Sweden abandoned making its own tank and went shopping for a replacement. The German Leopard knocked the spots off the competition. Would you let your 18-year-old kid take it out of the garage? And my name's Johnson. I'm the driver. I'm the commander. My name is uh, Christian Janssen. My name is Chad Kelly. I'm the uh, gunner. My name is Josef Rosen, and I'm uh, the loader of this tank. I'm also the chef. The greatest ever joined the Swedish army conscripts as they began an 11-day combat exercise, getting to know the Leopard's world-class technology. Six months ago, they left home for military service. And probably they had never been driven. They swapped the family Volvo for 62 tons of killing machine. And it's the Leopard's world-beating user-friendliness that lets these youths tear up the tundra with confidence. No steering levers or crash gearboxes here. It's almost like uh, driving a car, but it's a bit uh, heavier. Today, we are going to drive like uh, maniacs. The steering wheel looks like a car steering wheel. A seat here, uh, very comfortable to sit in. A uh, sports car type of seat, uh, produced by Recaro. Very simple uh, compartment, looks quite much as a car. A uh, big white pedal in the middle, that's the brake. You can stop 62 and a half tons, about 9 meters. We are gonna drive the tank to its uh, bitter end. I will make them feel confidence with this tank. The attitude is to get them to be hunters, to feel the tank. The extraordinary performance of the Leopard is enhanced by its radical modular design. It's actually an enormous kit of parts, all easily replaceable. And just like your Mercedes, when something goes wrong, you don't reach for your wrench, you grab your laptop. For my maintenance, I have a laptop. I connect it to the separate modules, and I can test them individually. 